all eyes closed. As I read the scripture, all eyes closed. And follow me in your spirit. For Zion's sake, will I not hold my peace? And for Jerusalem's sake, I will not rest. Until the righteousness therefore go forth as brightness. And the salvation thereof as a lamb that burneth. And the Gentiles shall see thy righteousness. And all kings shall see thy glory. And thou shalt be called by a new name. Which the mouth of the Lord shall name. Thou shalt also be a crown of glory in the hand of the Lord. And a royal diadem in the hand of thy God. Thou shalt no more be time forsaken. Neither shall the land any more be termed desolate. But thou shalt be called Epsiba. And thy land Beulah. For the Lord delighted in thee. And the land shall be married. I have set watchmen over thy walls. O Jerusalem. Jerusalem. We shall never hold their peace day and night. Ye that make mention of the Lord, keep not silence and give him no rest till he establish Jerusalem, Jerusalem, make Jerusalem a place in the earth. I'm going to pray now. The person who wants the greatest touch of God in this October month. And it took back faith for work on Lord, near it took God, you learn, you know, should talk on Oshuawai. Allow Israel, amen, to ring like fire and like thunder. For it that you pay a me to one to be no Osin song, Biara. After this prayer, I'm going to ask you to pray too. Then you are doing what was of a care, Badura. And I want you to pray with fire and with thunder. Must be a Badura be not Yara. Father, in the name. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, because you are the Alpha and Omega. Thank you because there is no power that is beyond your power. Thank you because your word says, They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Thank you because your word says, Every enemy that comes against us shall flee from before our face. If they come against us in one way, they shall flee in seven ways. Father, as many of your people as are connected with this program now, and who are in this program now, it is written and though we walk in the flesh, we do not walk after the flesh. But the weapons of our warfare are not But they are mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds, casting down every imagination and every eye thing that exhausts itself against the knowledge of God. Therefore, any tool of saltation of sorcerers, enchanters, covens against your life, I command them to scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Those marine powers. I want that on me. 
that have been contesting with your life contesting with your destiny I decree right now that whatsoever covenant is attaching you to this water spirit whatsoever covenant is attaching you to any stubborn spirit husband spirit wife whatsoever covenant has kept your body in prison whatsoever covenant has kept your spirit in prison right there where you are I separate you from that covenant now in the name of Jesus be separated 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 in the name of Jesus Oh yes. Yes. Ben. As many people as are in this program, and the enemy has fired the arrow of paralysis upon the hand, upon the leg. So what have you said? In the name which is above all names, let the arrows of paralysis go back to the sender. In the name of Jesus. Aha! Right there where you are. If they have assisted you to come to this program, and you cannot use your hand and your leg. The healing power of God is coming upon you now. In the name which is above all names, arise and be healed in the name of Jesus. Aha. Then. Yes. Then. Yes. Then. Do what you could not do with the hand and the leg. And run quickly to the altar here. Once the power of God has touched you, and you can use your hand, your leg, you can do what you could not do before. Run quickly to this altar now. Every rage of the oppressor in the life of anyone here. Every rage of darkness in the life of anyone here, beginning from now, I terminate the rage in the name of Jesus. Something is happening over there. Yes. Let the rage be terminated in the name of Jesus. Aha. Baby. Stretch, stretch your right hand towards this altar. No, a word to rest. Why you prefer you? Father, let your power flow into this hand. Let this hand destroy every witchcraft sponsored infirmity. Let this hand destroy every plantation of darkness. In the name of Jesus. Now, if you have any infirmity in your body, without apology. Slap the place 21 times. Shouting fire. Let's go. Do it well. Do it well. That's the power of God. That's the power of God.
Amen. Yes. Arise and be healed. You don't go by what's on. Amen. Amen. Check your body now. Yeah, I'm glad I'm glad. Do what you could not do before you got here. If you cannot walk, walk. If you cannot run, run. If you cannot bend, bend. If you cannot hear, hear. If there is any swelling in your body, check it now. The hand of God has taken it out. And run quickly to this altar. If you have been healed, run quickly to the altar. Don't let the devil put it back. Look at what is happening over there. That's a, that bone. The fire of God is touching the bone. The bone, the bone. That's the power of God coming upon you. Run quickly to the altar here. Don't let the devil put it back. Father, I'm praying right now. For anyone in this gathering, the enemy has given you a basket hand and a basket pocket. Everything you are touching is being stolen away. Right there where you are. The covenant between you and this strange spirit. I break it now in the name of Jesus. Oh yes, baby. I break it now in the name of Jesus. Aha, aha. Ben, ben. Aha, Silence. Did I get a lot? Silence. Did I get a lot? Don't say anything now. The fire of God is about to come on fourteen people. In no Lord of Pale in your many la you will physically feel the fire. El Moino Lara ne patara gogo where you are. You be the drus these fourteen people. I went in many light. The enemy has been attacking you. Or that in bogo to ye which which crap cobwebs. The Lujan carry wage they cover you. Sometimes physically. But fire will fall upon you now. And destroy the witchcraft cobwebs. At the count of seven. That fire will fall upon you. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Yes, it's clear enough. It's clear enough. You can't hide. You have been hiding for years. This is not a place where you hide. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I'm praying for anyone here. Who's Destiny has been caged in the place of birth. And they have determined that you will be forever stagnant. Whatever power is holding you down now. In the name which is above all the in the name of Jesus, Jesus Christ, I destroy the power. 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 In the name of Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, my captain, the abortion, holy and Aha, then something has happened to that man over there. Don't you share yourself for any way? My capotali, Kaya Bushin, the Rabasanta, Aha, then Father, Baba, I'm praying right now. For all the sicknesses that suddenly started after a dream attack, 
Every sickness that started from the night from a dream attack wherever such people are now receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus receive your deliverance receive it 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 let your heaven be louder receive it receive it receive it in the name of Jesus Check your body now. Yeah, I've got it over. Check it very well. Yeah, would that, that. Once you can do what you could not do before, get over the wrong to get to this altar. My duo, can't can do what you can buy. That's right. Baby. That's right. Baby. That is right. Good day. That's right. Good day. This is not a day to negotiate. I do not do that as many as are in this garden. And you have been noticing general blockage. I'm going to count seven. Smite your head seven times. As I seven. And whatever is Linking you up with that spirit of blockage will jump out of your life. But do it very well. Do it very well. Don't feel sorry for that head at all. One, two, three. The blockage is. I want to do what? It's getting out. One jaddy. It's getting out. One jaddy. Four. Eddie. Five. Eddie. Six. Eddie. Seven. Eddie. You can't hide. Oh, Le Farasi. That's right. Yeah. You can't hide. Oh, Le Farasi. I'm going to count seven from here again. All those who are here today, and anytime something good is coming your way, there is a terrible attack, and those things will vanish. Right there where you are, as I can seven from here, the power of God will fall upon you, and that yoke will be broken instantly. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Woman, check your body. Check that lump in the breast. Check that swollen, swollen part in the womb. It has just been surgically removed from heaven. Run quickly to this altar. Don't let the devil put it back. Father, I'm praying for those who are here. And the enemy has swallowed the joy in your marriage. Right there where you are. Whether it is convenient for the enemy or not. Receive your deliverance now in the name of Jesus. Receive it. 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 Aha, aha. Now the power God, now the power God. Receive it now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Aha. Daddy.
It's your turn to pray now. A very strong prayer. A prayer that you must not negotiate with the enemy. Can you shout this loud and clear? Glory killers. Embargo of my father's house. Can you shout this loud? Your voice is not loud. Enough. I think you should try harder than that. Okay, Damn! In the name of Jesus. Enough is enough. Bata sete la kaya bo shendera basanta. Yes, 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 yes. name we pray something is about to happen divine acceleration uncommon promotion mysterious elevation is about to happen now now don't let anybody's voice be louder than yours in this second prayer you will shout the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ! Great physician! I am available! Touch me now! Jesus Christ, great physician, I am available. Touch me now. 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 Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Receive the torture of the power. Receive the torture of the power. Receive it. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Somebody is receiving a brand new heart. Somebody is receiving a brand new kidney. Somebody is receiving a brand new womb. That is the first person. That's number two. As a material, any 
Check your body now. Check your body. Yeah. Once you have been healed, run to the altar. Don't allow the devil to put it back at all. Thank you, Jesus. 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 You now pray this particular prayer. Arrows of delayed blessing. Can you shout it louder than that? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Listen. That fell over there. If you don't put your faith into action, and you are listening to the voice of your symptom, you will remain as you are. But the great physician is by your side. Right there where you are. What you've not been able to do for years. What you've never done before. I command you right now. In the name which is above all names. Jesus Christ. Begin to do so now. Receive the touch of God. By for work alone. Yes, put your faith into action. Aha. That which you could not do for years. The strength of God is coming upon you. The power and the fire of the God of Elijah is coming upon you. Yes. Once you can do so, run quickly to the altar. If you cannot move fast, let somebody help you. The power of God is falling upon you. Like electric current from the top of your head to the sole of your feet. Aha, aha. Then, aha. Then. Yes. Then listen to the voice of Jesus. Don't listen to the voice of the enemy. Yes. Then put that faith into action. The power of God is by your side. We're waiting for you. And Has broken all the fetters. He has broken all the fetters. He has broken all the fetters. He has set me free. He has broken. Can all the feather ever? He has broken all the feather. He has broken all the feather. He has set me free. I will sing Hallelujah. I will sing Hallelujah. I will sing Hallelujah. He has set me free. 
I will sing, I will sing. Hallelujah. I will sing. Hallelujah. I will sing. Hallelujah. We are sad. Father, we cover your signs and wonders say, with the blood of Jesus. Continue to lay your hands upon your people. In Jesus' name. Let's remain standing. Pick any song of praises in your mouth. And sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings. And to the Lord of Lords. To Lua, to Lua. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Abi. Father, Baba, continue to lay your hands upon your people. That is why you know, Father, Demonstrate in the life of everyone. Everyone, you know, I look, look, who that the God of Elijah is still on duty. The Lord of Elijah, who did our schedule. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. The Lord of Jesus Christ, the Lord. Let's have a seat for a few minutes. God bless you. Let's have a seat for a few minutes. God bless you. Let's have a as we take our Bibles. The same Psalm 22. Verse 16. Verse 16. Look at what could happen again to that fit. Look at what could happen again to that fit. 22, 16. For dogs have compassed me. The assembly of the wicked have enclosed me. They pierce my hands and my feet. Now in Romans chapter 10, verse 15. Romans 10 15. And how shall they preach? Except they be sent. Because you pray on one. As it is written, how beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of peace. How beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of peace. And bring glad tidings of good things. I want him was to hear your own lady unto every organ of the body. There is a spiritual counterpart. We have dealt with the hand at the the mystery of the feet is something that many Christians do not understand. Your feet, as it is, has been empowered by God to establish your dominion and rulership on earth. Jesus said, I give unto you power to tread upon serpent and scorpion and over every power of the enemy and nothing shall by enemies hurt you. So if 
that faith should have a problem. Then shame and disgrace is it the outcome. You? The faith could be spiritually attacked. And it will affect your physical work. It could affect your physical life, affect your dominion authority. There are some places you go to. Where you are finished going there, you need to break curses off your feet. The feet is mostly neglected sometimes during spiritual warfare. We concentrate on the head mostly, and for a good reason too. But then the feet is neglected. But even in normal language, the importance of the feet is, is very critical. If somebody says you have developed cold feet, it means that you are, you are backing out, you are changing your mind. If they say you have put your foot in your mouth, me, you are saying the wrong or inappropriate thing. If somebody says, please put your foot down, it means you must be firm and strong. If somebody buys something and says, you have to foot the bill, it means you have to pay. If somebody says, get on your feet, is asking you to get established. If they say you are stepping on toes, it means you are talking about things others who prefer not to hear. You are creating something others don't want to know about. So without feet, you could worship the Lord. You could reference the Lord. You could trample upon serpents and scorpions. And when you have defeated the enemy, the Bible says you will defeat that enemy by putting your leg on the neck of the enemy. Therefore, putting something under your feet in scripture, it means the thing is now under your subjection. Bruising the heels in scripture, it means an attack on that leg. Treading under feet in scripture is a symbol of subduing and conquering. When the Bible says you are washing your feet in blood, it's telling you that you are executing your enemies. When you dip, when the Bible says you are dipping your foot in oil, it means you are having abundant portion. So your feet will establish your dominion in the garden of your destiny. A person can step into something physically, it will affect you spiritually. That that your feet is the key and instrument of your possession. Is the instrument of your breakthrough. Once your feet is blessed, hindrance will give way to the presence of your feet. When your feet is blessed, your Jordan of hindrance will give way. The Bible says, How beautiful are the feet of them that preach the gospel of Christ. Meaning that the reverse too can be true. A person could have spiritually ugly feet. And once 
goes into an environment, everything turns upside down. The entrance of the business, the business turns upside down. Your feet is instrument of protection and direction. Your feet is the ladder to move into greatness in life. Your feet is an instrument of deliverance. Instrument of expansion and progress. It's the key to establish your victory over all your enemies. Your feet is therefore a weapon of warfare. Therefore, a polluted feet, a weak feet, paralyzed feet, cannot succeed in the battle of life. When the feet is under attack, there are symptoms for the ugly bad feet. Do you notice yourself always walking into trouble? You need deliverance of the feet. You see yourself walking into danger. You need deliverance of the feet. You find yourself untaked by the atmosphere of death. You need deliverance of the feet. You find that you are always arriving late at the places of honor. You need deliverance of the feet. You find yourself walking to frustration and disappointment always. You need deliverance of the feet. You find instability in your business, your career, marriage, relationships. You need deliverance of the feet. And anytime you as a sister, you are dreaming of shoes. Know that those shoes represent marriage. So you shouldn't dream of just wearing one shoe. Or you are barefooted. It's a very bad sign for marriage. When the feet is ugly, people walk away from places of honor into places of suffering. Vagabond powers will operate in the life of a man whose feet is not delivered. When the feet is bad, the entrance of a person brings sorrow. A person brings sorrow. His exit brings joy. When the fit needs deliverance, that what to call geographical confusion. Always wrongly positioned. There will be acidic poverty. A lot of people have inherited the bad feet. And is following them all over the place. A lot of people have materials on their feet which have subjected their feet to bondage. Some have stepped on charms. Some have incision on their feet. Some are suffering from witchcraft arrows on that feet. In some cases, evil men have removed the dust from under some people's feet. And they are now using it against you. Some have put charms on your footprints. There could be curses by satanic agents. You may have undergone demonic feet washing. Or you have used a satanic body cream on your leg. Or you have gone into the occultic centers. Thereby polluting your feet. All these are the reasons why the feet is sometimes in trouble. We have serious work to do here today. But to succeed in it, 
The first thing is to surrender your life to Jesus. Second thing is to repent and forsake all sins. Third thing, you carry out an inventory of your life. And for carry out this deliverance of the feet. And then now barricade your feet so it will take you to the right place at the right time and it will not walk you into why you should not walk into it. Jesus brought you here for a purpose. And this purpose is to bless your life. We're going to start those prayers now. But listen to me carefully. The next part of St. James essentially a deliverance service. Concentrating on inherited evil patterns and collective captivity. So you still have to come with your oil and wear clothes where you can have access to your body body where, those, where you can have access to your belly button. Palm of changes. But right now, we're going to deal with all these feet diseases. Please, rise to your feet now. Please, everybody, rise to your feet now. But you see, if you are here, you have not just surrendered your life to Jesus. And you are seeking for deliverance. The first thing is to surrender your life to Jesus. So if you are here, you say, Pastor, I want to get born again. I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Find a way quickly to the altar at the front here. Or any of the two altars at the back. And do that very quickly because we want to go and pray. This is the first step towards complete deliverance. You are here to surrender your life to Jesus. Just leave that seat and come quickly to the altar here. Or go to any of the two altars. Jesus is waiting for you here. Do that very, very quickly. You have the opportunity today. Thank you, Jesus. 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 I surrender. Amen. Amen. Those of you at the altar, I congratulate you. You've taken the most important decision in life. And the Lord bless you as you do so. Whatever you are hearing us too, if you want to surrender your life to Jesus, find a way to the altar of that church where you are. Say this after me. Say, Father, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. In Jesus' name. Amen. I'm going to pray with you now. Father, I thank you for your children here. Uphold them by your power. Lay your hands upon them. Move in their lives in a new way. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Right there where you are. The counselors will speak with you and give you more instructions. The rest of us, let's bow our heads. Tell the Lord to forgive you of any sin that will hinder your deliverance here today. Talk to the Lord now. Father, I thank you for your children.
bring out your own oil now. And pour a little bit on your palm. Is it good yes? Father, Baba, this oil Ororoyi, that your children brought here, let the sanctifying power, glorifying power of the Holy Ghost fall upon it in the name of Jesus. On application of this oil, let there be on common breakthroughs. Let there be a disgrace of every blockage. When you go fire, I'm tied to this oil. I'm tied to this oil. Blood of Jesus, I'm tied to this oil. Thank you, Jesus. Now use the oil to rub your feet. And I shall not stumble. I shall move and I shall not be paralyzed. I shall not walk into slavery. I shall walk every day in victory and liberty of the spirit. Anywhere I step into, the Lord will give it to me. There shall not be anyone who will be able to stand on the way to my progress all the days of my life. As I anoint my feet today, I, Daniel Olukoya, shall have dominion over every power of the enemy in the name of Jesus do it again a second time put the oil on your hand again second time now anoint the legs again say my feet Hear the word of the Lord. Receive the anointing to become beautiful feet. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every hand of the strong man upon my legs die in the name of Jesus. Any power of death assigned against my legs die in the name of Jesus. My feet hear the word of the Lord locate my prosperity in the name of Jesus every arrow of failure fired into my legs backfire 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 in the name of Jesus lay your hands on your leg now and shout on top of that leg. Let nobody's voice be louder than yours. Every chain upon my legs break in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and break the chains. Yes. In 
Jesus name we pray this next prayer pray with anger any curse issued against my life in the name of Jesus open your mouth and break the curses Jesus name we pray. Lord of God, Jesus, Abadura. Get us separated. As I count now, if you want to call, smite your right leg. Then we go to the left later. As you smite, anything contrary to your progress there, we go back to the sender. One. Any? The right leg, the right leg. One, eighty, two, eighty, three, four, five, six, seven. The serpent is coming out. Go to the left now. One, eighty, two, eighty, three, four, five, six, seven. Aha. I decree upon your life now by the decree of heaven that beginning from today move into your next level in the name of Jesus possess your possession in the name of Jesus thank you heavenly father Father, we are praying for those who are celebrating their birthday this month. It shall be well with them. They will go from strength to strength and from glory to glory. In the name of Jesus, by this time next year, if you tarry in your coming, there shall be greater bundle of testimonies. In the name of Jesus, bring out your prayer letter rise to your feet and point it to us at the altar here your prayer letter rise to your feet point it straight at this altar and let your amen roar like thunder father in the name of Jesus we bring this prayer letter before you after the order of Ezekiah. Answer by fire. Answer by fire. Answer by fire. Let every point written in this letter become uncommon testimonies. In the name of Jesus, a seven fold man. Bring your anointing here to the next palm of strangers. It's victory over evil inheritance. Inherited pattern and collective captivity. The Lord blesses you from Zion. Make his face to shine upon you. And be gracious unto you. You will go from strength to strength. And from glory to glory. No weapon form against you shall prosper. I prophesy upon your life that by the next power of St. Your testimony shall be huge. In the name of Jesus, the eyes that not that stomach or sleep shall be upon you. Any tragedy left in this year shall not be your lot. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Let us share the grace in fellowship.